This is my first video in my new series, Constellation of the Week. Videos will be released every Monday, and will have information about the Constellation of the Week, which is a certain constellation, that is well visible after nightfall that week. I will be using text-to-speech for this series. Let me know what you think in the comments. Sorry if the audio quality is not great, I'm kinda making this video in a rush. Constellation of the Week 1, Sagittarius, Monday, October 17, 2022, through Sunday, October 23, 2022. The Bayer designation for stars in Sagittarius are Alpha, Beta, Gamma, etc. followed by Sagittarius. Sagittarius represents an arrow, and is abbreviated as G. E. Sagittarius rough coordinates. Right ascension, 20 hours. Declination, plus 20 degrees. Sagitta has a northern constellation, but is also close to the celestial equator. This is a diagram of Sagitta. It has five stars, and only one of those stars has a proper name. Sagitta is on the edge of the Milky Way, in the sky. Above Sagitta is Vulpecula, Cygnus is above that but it doesn't fit on screen. Delphinus is on the left, and Aquila, below, only a bit of Aquila fits, on the screen. The orientation is not always this way, but the constellations never move relative to each other. Sagittarius is a small constellation. All of Sagittarius is always visible from at least 72 degrees north. Sagittarius is sometimes visible from 72 degrees north and 72 degrees south. Sagittarius is never visible from at least 72 degrees south. It is best visible soon after sunset in September, October, and November. Asterisms are patterns of stars that are not constellations. While Sagittarius is not part of an asterism, it is located inside of one known as the Summer Triangle. It is also near the Northern Cross. Between Gamma Sagittarius and Delta Sagittarius is a globular cluster known as Messier 71, or M71. M71 has an apparent magnitude of 6.1, and is made up of over 20,000 stars. Sagittarius, despite being an arrow, does not belong to Sagittarius, the archer. Sagittarius represents the arrow that was used by Hercules to kill an eagle. The eagle, however, was sent by Zeus to punish the titan Prometheus. In fact, the constellation Aquila, which is near Sagittarius, represents that eagle. Fun fact about Sagittarius, it is the third smallest constellation of all 88 that are officially recognized by the International Astronomical Union. And the only constellations that are smaller than Sagittarius are Aquilius and Crux. Sagittarius is not a zodiacal constellation. A zodiacal constellation is a constellation that the ecliptic goes through. The ecliptic is the flat plane that the sun, moon, and planets in our solar system are on. This means you will never see something in our solar system in the direction of Sagittarius, at least from Earth. Go out and see Sagittarius tonight. The next video in the Constellation of the Week series will be releasing on Monday, October 24th. Hint, the next one is an animal. That does not include human.